why didn't anybody tell me it was gonna be this doggone hot outside? See, how my eggs, not so bad. Is that Nikita Marie? I'm oh, filming! Oh my god, somebody help! She's crazy. Jingle with me, baby. What's up, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. It's your girl, Jazz. I'm back with another video. If you guys don't know, I create lifestyle videos and I show you guys parts of these in my everyday life. So yeah, it's the start of a new vlog. Last night, I did post the day in the life of an Instacart shopper so you guys can get a perspective to see what it's like. I did post that super late, like 1 o'clock in the morning, but you guys still viewed it, so you guys enjoyed it. Crazy thing is, I think my tripod just went falling, bro. What I was trying to say before I got interrupted by this tripod is I think a lot of my followers are like on the west coast. I'm actually about to look this up right now. So the last time I looked at this, a lot of my people were in Texas and in California. Surprisingly, not that much in Virginia. Yeah, I don't wanna watch me in Virginia, it's okay. But um, yeah, <laughs> let me see the cities real fast. I'm trying to look. Yeah, Dallas, Texas is number one. Okay, this is the new lead for you guys that have been watching. It's Dallas, Texas, then New York, then Atlanta, Chicago and LA and I got a lot of Texas on here. How do I go by state? Hold on. Give me one second y'all. Okay. Here's my state. Okay. I click the US Yeah, Texas is lead. So it's Texas then California then Florida then Georgia then Illinois That's crazy. Okay, and Virginia is like way down a couple more down like this is one two three four five six seven eleven twelve virginia step your game up we got to get top 10 because i live in virginia y'all don't even want to watch me y'all see me enough here i guess that's what it is but today anyways we got to see what we're going to get into for the day this is going to be a um you know chill vlog we got some stuff going on this weekend that i got to prepare for for one this evening we're going to go see my cousin at her dance recital i haven't gotten a chance to see her dance yet i only seen from video so i haven't seen her live in person so that's going to be a nice little surprise meet up with the fam probably go get something to eat and stuff like that and then um i need to prepare for tomorrow because we have another little trip tomorrow possibly not really a full trip you know just going to a meet in another city but i don't think i'm gonna show you guys that i try not to keep posting you know that me and my nephew and stuff like that let them share that if they want to just because of personal reasons i don't expose certain things if you know what i mean but trust me auntie got all the videos and stuff hidden on my drive because we're gonna make a big post about this one day but um yeah we got to go support him for that they switched locations so that's another thing but um i'm gonna get prepared for that later and we're just gonna see what we're gonna get into today like i said yesterday you guys like the day in the life of an instacart shopper just to get my perspective and stuff like that every day is different it's pretty cool i'm trying to eat my breakfast as i'm talking to y'all but i feel like i don't even want this anymore as long as i got my coffee i'm good to go which is bad because i'm trying to do better i gotta eat more so i can lose weight and get to the gym and i haven't even been able to get to the gym because of all this vlogmas stuff i've been getting behind with editing then i had got sick so all of that but i'm about to get back on track pretty soon thankfully i can get more fun and exciting content because I, I wouldn't say the other content was boring but i just feel like i have a whole lot more energy now and i know a lot of you guys have been um wishing me well and things like that and some of you guys have been going through stuff too which is really crazy i'm telling you remember i told you about that fog that day when i saw all that fog i said i was going to keep my mask on a bit that'd be no bird box type stuff and then all of a sudden everybody was getting sick I don't know if there's a correlation, but I'm just saying. It's like, nah, I'm not one of those conspiracy people and stuff like that, but yeah, it's just crazy. Uh, there was a bug going around for sure, but some people are st still catching it. Some people are recovering, and it's a whole nother, a whole nother issue, whole nother story, but your girl is feeling back better, so I'm happy to entertain you guys again, but I've been over here doing my little business admin stuff. I need to scan my receipts, because your girl be doing fetch. I don't care how much you make and what you do. I'm gonna always scan my little fetch receipt because I end up getting cashback rewards. You can get gas with this. You can go on Amazon and get you some fun stuff to try or whatever. You can get clothes. There's all kinds of stuff to do on fetch. And I'm not sponsored by the way. I'm just saying. But you can act like you're too good if you want to. But while you, if you're too good, give me your receipt and I'll scan it on mine because I be getting some some serious cash from fetch. You can get some serious rewards from this. So I definitely save my receipts and I be scanning them things. But yeah, your girl's done with her little intro. I gotta get done with some little admin stuff. I did a little bit already 
more like on the business side I'm trying to get this back more serious and stuff so I got to get going with the business and I, I don't like talking to you guys' ears off in the beginning which I'm doing right now so I'm gonna do more showing and less talking and let me cut the cameras and then I'll you know how I do God. dang and I forgot to throw that chicken away y'all why didn't anybody tell me it was gonna be this doggone hot outside it feels like I gotta take the I can't hold on I can't function right now I'm so hot it feels like it's a good 70 something outside and I had that thick old warm coat oh that smells good y'all remember when I went to Bath and Body Works and I got that luminous I need to turn this AC on I can't even think hold up y'all give me one second shoot it is hot how the heck do I put this I'm struggling I'm sweating I'm about to sweat Make me hot, make me sweat hotter water, make me lose Whew. my edges. All right, so I definitely was supposed to put this in the trash. But yeah, y'all, it feels like it's about 70 something degrees outside. Yesterday it was all cold and now it's warm. I'm telling you, this weather will make you sick, bro. But we got the order down. This is the one I got, remember from Bath and Body Works, that luminous. I'm about to spray some again because it smells, shoot, AC. It smells that good but yeah look I, I just had to tell y'all that for a quick second because what the weather got me stuttering i got gushers and i gotta get my address okay so y'all listen i know i've been talking about the pink friday album how i wasn't really feeling it i didn't realize the beat beat was on there i listened to um not listened to but i saw kai that stream with nikki on there i thought that was hilarious i just watched it last night actually but that's not what made me, you know, a fan that made me want to listen to it. There's a couple songs I think I do like. I just don't ever know the names of them. I have to listen to the album so many times just to figure it out. And this is one I'm going to have to keep listening to. Because I think I only listened to like three or four. Kind of skip through. And then actually hearing her kind of explain some of the stuff on there. I'm definitely going to listen to more. And actually, you know, catch the vibe and see what I get from it. I feel like a lot of times, sometimes you like certain artists because of, you know, the beats, the music, their style. And kind of what's trending. But then a lot of times for me personally, I connect with artists from how you see them in their personal life. You know, they really engage with people. So, like, one person I know that people absolutely hate on is, like, DDG. People cannot stand him because of, I guess, where he's from. People don't like him there. Or because he does streaming and YouTube. And they think he wants to be, like, this wannabe rapper. They say he sucks and all this stuff. He honestly is not bad. Just like any other artist, they have to grow and get better. And he has his own sound that was different from, you know, a lot. It's kind of, Some things are similar and some are different. But at the same time, he still has his, like, own style. And the man is a marketing genius. The way he can market and, you know, his songs go viral, regardless if it is because of TikTok, Instagram, social media dances and all that. He still went viral and got people talking about his song and his music, which a lot of people can't do. So you can't knock him for his hustle. And he really has seems to live like a carefree life. I'm not the type that, you know, go so hard and, you know, in the comments for people and all that extra stuff. But I do definitely support because you can't knock his hustle. What he did for his family, put his family on and the way he still continually grows and does stuff. So that's another thing. I like artists I can connect with. But yeah, I think I'm pretty close to the house now. I'm trying to figure out where the heck I got to go because my GPS is not sinking. But I'm going back to the Pink Friday again because I was listening to the song and I just thought about it and had to tell you guys. I also forgot to tell you while I'm taking a break in between um, this order real fast. I saw this comment on Instagram when they were talking about the Pink Friday album. And some guy put a list of, I guess, how the songs were. And I meant to look at that also and look at some of the songs. So that's what I'm about to do now while I wait. Because I'm not about to drive far. I got to go out later today and I just want to do a couple like close by in these areas that way i can get home without worrying about being in traffic and then we can leave on time because i don't know how the traffic is going to be there we're going to the pentagon city mall and yeah that's all i gotta say okay y'all so quick little change of plans we are still going to see my cousin did i say pentagon mall or did i say springfield mall we're going to springfield mall to see her perform i feel like i kept saying pentagon everywhere but yeah i was gonna change but i'm just gonna leave what i have on for now because i gotta go get gas now we gotta pick up my sister from their place and i don't want to be rushing for time because i already gotta leave now traffic here is ridiculous i just put another headband on your girl's looking like i got a headband wig on but that's okay i don't care my hair still look good anyways but yeah i just gotta do a few little things like i gotta finish my laundry real fast before we go 
I gotta fold so much clothes when I get back and then get ready for tomorrow. At this point, I just need to be comfortable, hurry up and go and get what I gotta do because I still didn't even do my business stuff, but I'm gonna have to do that in the car and figure out what I gotta do on the way there. <coughs> I'm choking off the spray, god dang. See, all my Uggs, not so bad. Let's get out of here. Finally made it, and where are these people at? Jaywalkers, they're jaywalkers. Caught. <laughs> that looks nice. <laughs> Whose performance is it? <laughs> I was gonna say, how is everybody's food? I don't like so salt. Awesome. I didn't ask to be recorded. Is that Nikita Marie? If this, if this goes oh, on, oh, it doesn't zoom. If this goes on YouTube, I will be calling my attorney. I'm a blocker. Don't film me. Oh my God, somebody help! She's crazy. But she running in the camera. Well, since she doesn't know us, we'll lock the doors. Why are you stepping on me? Why are you stepping on me? I'm, I'm, you bum. I'm, I'm like, I'm about to call the cops. <laughs> He's about to help. Wait, uh, was he white? Now you knock my sock off. <laughs> I gotta fix my sock. That's my people. What the heck is that? <laughs> what was that? You over here trying to help somebody. <laughs> Do the walk again. <laughs> That's not what it looks like when you come up on somebody. That's what is this? <laughs> <laughs> Did she almost fall? That was a big leap for her little legs. <laughs> I can't stop looking at her feet. Her feet. Huh? Her feet. <laughs> I can't breathe. <laughs> yeah. Wait. <laughs> Let's go run down the hill and beat her. Rocky Banoa. <laughs> She's still going. Hold on. <laughs> it's too cold. Ugh. Why is he still running like this? <laughs> Alright y'all, so here's the deal. There's not going to be a vlog today. I'm going to combine today and tomorrow's because it's about 10, 11 at night. I've been starting these editings about 10, 11 o'clock and don't upload them to like 11, 12. Last night I uploaded at 1 and today's just not one of those days that's going to get done to be honest. Um, I have a lot to do tomorrow and I really want to get rest up because the driving that we have to do. The last time I did that, I was so bad, exhausted. I don't know, that's when I was actually sick, but or getting sick, rather. That probably was like right before I started getting sick, because the next day is when I felt it. But anyways, I still want to get nice and good rest so I can do things later on after this and not, you know, be too over-exhausted, because I've been doing good doing these daily uploads, and it's okay. It's not the end of the world if I didn't make it, but I'm still going to combine these two days together. And as you can see what I'm saying... I forgot I came home and had to do all this laundry and I still have more in the dryer to do. So, what your girl is about to do tonight, I'm going to actually eat the rest of that food, finish folding my clothes while I listen to some lives, take me a nice shower, import my photos and have it rendered, and I'm probably going to edit in the car tomorrow on the way there to the track meet, because this time we're going kind of almost the same area, but to a different location. And this is going to be a big one as well, so I got to prepare for this and get nice and rested because, you know, like I said, the drive and all that stuff. I want to make sure, you know, I'm taking care of myself, like I said. So, oh, also, let me show you. So, we ended up going to Yard House with my aunt and the family, and 
what I ordered was this Japanese Philly cheesesteak. I didn't really show you guys because it was so dark in there. It was pretty good, but everything was like super salty. I don't know what it was. Everything was salty, but maybe I needed an, a little extra electrolyte to help me boost because I don't even think I really ate anything today, to be honest, and I forgot. So tripod fell again. I need to make sure I actually eat something and eat this and then get ready for tomorrow because I think I got to get up at like three in the morning again. So like I said, that editing was not getting done because the last time I only slept for three or four hours. But your girl has some work to do. So I'll catch you guys tomorrow when we leave.